I need to stop talking after you the need question. You three seconds. <laughs> and then... And, and then, then say a bad joke. <laughs> <laughs> How did this martyr die? St. Cassian. Hacked to death by his children. Crucified upside down. See, thrown into a kiln and bought alive. De scaled to ego alive. Oh These are all gosh. terrible. <laughs> yeah. Hacked <laughs> to death by children. That's horrible. Um, all right, final answer C. Yeah, okay. D. Scalped and eaten alive. How we do? No. Oh. <laughs> yeah. What? Hacked to death by children? Yeah. All right, we're gonna go there. <laughs> Uh, I believe it. You are uncanny. <laughs> oh my Let's god. Go. It was hacked no, to death by children. No, really? By his children? That's horrible. Saint Cassian. He was a teacher of students in the Roman Empire during the 4th century. When he wouldn't sacrifice their Roman gods, he was tied to a stake and his students stabbed him with their riding sticks. Uh, Saint... <laughs> dim Dim... How do you pronounce this? Dim... 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 A, tied to an anchor and thrown into the sea. Oof. B, burned alive at a stake. C, beheaded by father. That's cruel. Or D, impaled by a spear. <sighs> All right, gut reaction here. What do you think? Not B, yes. not burned alive. I'm thinking something more creative. I think uh, beheaded by father. Beheaded by father? I have no idea. All right, we'll <laughs> go with instinct. We're saying C. Okay, we'll go with C. Wow. wow. <laughs> We're good at this. <laughs> Killing it. <laughs> oh, that was a bad joke. <laughs> Saint Dimphna, a saint who lived in the seventh century. When her mother died, her father searched for someone to replace her. Because Dimphna looked like her mother, he tried to take his daughter as his new wife. She refused, so he killed her. She is a patron saint of those who suffer from mental illness. Yeah, you're in a roll. Let's go. How did okay. this martyr die? I'm sensing a pattern here. Saint Ignatius of Antioch. Saint Ignatius of Antioch. <laughs> a, eaten by lions. B, mauled by leopards. <laughs> C, torn apart by wild horses. And poisoned by cobras. Animals uh, hate this guy. I feel like I've heard the wild horses one. It was probably C. That, that sounds painful. What, you could just get tied and they say, go. And they just black out and they go. Oh boy. You got the horses in the back, huh? C, all right, I'm gonna go with the guy. Torn apart by a wild horse. I don't test well anyway. Cobras. Poisoned by cobras? Oh. oh! Don't you just want to say mauled by leopards because it sounds fun? Mauled by leopards. Even though it's not true. Lions. He was eaten by lions. Okay. Right. <laughs> you got it right, <laughs> Hey, okay. Blast. St. Ignatius of Antioch, follower of St. John and a bishop from Turkey who was arrested by the Roman Empire for being Christian. He was sent by boat to Rome to be killed by lions and along the way had time to write a number of letters that explain and encourage faith in people throughout Asia Minor. So, <laughs> thanks for you guys. <laughs>